Let's talk about the weather. Uh, I tell you, the clouds just would not leave today, and temperatures that started in the upper 60s this morning. This, this is the 7 a.m. in the morning. A live Dallas cam looking to the north. Clouds just, you know, you see a little bit of break. I'm going to stop it at noon. And you saw, do you see the little sprinkles there that happened just around the lunch hour? Yeah, then they were gone. The sun tried to break out, then the clouds run back in. This is our current uh, look right now. The morning low is 68. We're sitting at 74, so not much of a warm up through the course of the day. And if you look now, remember, we're looking north in this camera. So if you look north to the northwest, it looks like a little bit of rain. Indeed, there is a little bit of rain out there. And I'll show you here in just a second. But in Addison, it's 73. Duncanville, 71. 72 Mesquite. And very muggy out there, by the way. By the way, not your. Not your exaggeration. You're, you are feeling some very muggy air in place. That's the rain that you're seeing there on the sky cam. You can see here it's mostly, you know, to north along 35W corridor, but some of it's getting a little bit closer to Tarrant County. Right now it's over in Wise and slowly moving down to the south, but you can see a few areas of maybe moderate rain, very small, very light. Coverage is going to be small, 20% chance. It's ahead of this cold front. That's moving very slowly through the area through the course of the evening. So let me show you on Future Sky forecast what happens. This is at uh, six o'clock, and we think this is about where the front will be. By the way, it's exaggerating the coverage of the rain, but we do think the activity will pick up here in the next couple of hours with this light rain around, and it, it will again be around through the evening hours and start to taper off as we get to midnight. But here's the thing, it's not really going to go away. We're going to keep these small chances of light rain around, not only through the evening, through the overnight, and through Thursday morning's commute. There might be enough rain here to wet the roads in some locations, have you put on the windshield wiper. But all this returns as a warm front tomorrow. It won't help temperature wise. We'll still be in the 60s. But what that means is that we still have rain around tomorrow afternoon, even in tomorrow, even maybe even Friday morning before it starts to clear out Friday and then it really starts to warm up. We're talking about a high about 81 degrees on Friday on a very windy day. So we go to upper 60s tomorrow to 80s on Friday. If you're wondering about the weekend, another cold front comes through. It'll be dry, but it looks like temperatures will be in the 60s, and Sunday morning we'll have a little frost around. We'll have uh, temperatures trying to recover before another cold front arrives just before Thanksgiving. Guys.